So we're we're coming into Raymond Terrace this weekend, and you're fourth in the championship right now. Um, so how are you feeling about your season so far? Yeah, I've had a bit of an up and down season to be honest. Um, you know, started off started off pretty um, pretty average, and I really started to find my form. And then um, come Conondale, I just had a few things went wrong, and it's just one of those weekends where it just doesn't work out for you. But um, coming into Raymond Terrace this weekend, I'm really looking to bounce back and. Um, you know, show everyone what I can do and um, you know, really get back up there in the points. Um, I think I'm about 20 points off the lead, so I really need to um, you know, start winning motos and just start doing what I know I can do and then I'll, I'll come out shining. Yeah, so you got your um, MX2 win at Swan Hill. So um, how did that go and what did you think the differences were between you know, the two classes? Um, just maturity and probably a bit of respect. Um, surely, I, I, of course, everyone um, is racing each other, so there's going to be a little bit of um, bar banging going on, but I just found that everyone was more mature in the way they rode, and um, yeah, MX2 was unreal. I'm looking forward to getting into that class next year and um, battling with the big guys. Yeah, so um, you know, you're out here today at Appen in New South Wales, uh, preparing for the weekend, and you're riding with Jake Moss, who you ride with a fair bit. So, how does that deal work for you? And you think it, you know, it must really benefit you for for your improvement over the season? Yeah, it benefits me heaps, you know, we're, we're mates away from the track and we're training partners at the track. So, you know, we do our job at the track and we do our job away from the track training and, and other than that, we're just mates as well. So, hanging out with Jake is great, um, he's a great dude and yeah, it just um, really changes my whole aspect on life and, and racing as well. So yeah, it's been great working with him. Perfect. So, um, you know, finally you're stepping up to MX2 full time next year. So, and you've already taken the win. So what are your expectations coming into the, into the new year? Just um, just make sure I don't just just do what works for me and just get good results. You know, I always want to put in 110 percent, and as long as I can do that, usually my results show. So, yeah, just looking on um, getting a good program set next year on and off the bike, and um, yeah, hopefully it's going to be a good year. Cool, man. I well, appreciate the chat, and uh, good luck on the weekend. Thank you.